Yo, Michael Martinez here. I got a request to do a reaction to Melanie Martinez, no relation, cry baby. So we're gonna check that out right now, but I want to let you know to stick around to the end of the video and I'll let you know how you can win a $25 Amazon gift card from me. So let's go ahead and get started and check out Melanie Martinez, cry baby. What the heck? Is this Melanie? like this so far. Oh gosh. This is like an ASMR video so far. It's just kind of, I don't know how to feel. It's very, uh, she's acting more like she's making the baby than having it. Oh, that's weird. I didn't like that. Oh, that made me feel weird. I mean, I know it was like a pinata, so it kind of makes it okay because it wasn't actually a baby, but it just felt very wrong. I feel like I'm watching The Shining. Oh. He's gonna write Cry Baby, huh? <laughs> yeah. It's pretty good handwriting. Compared to mine. <laughs> Is she Melanie? You seem to replace your brain. She must be. Your heart, you take things so hard and then you fall apart. You try to explain, but before you can start, those cry baby tears come out of the dark. Someone's starting in the hand. like her voice. Sorry for the children at home watching. I didn't know there was going to be profanity in this video. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Say it's a little too weird for me, but people get really mad when you say stuff is weird. 
because of this world, this PC world we live in. Like, <laughs> I know we get into the whole conversation of, you know, weird is subjective, and, you know, to some people weird is beautiful and, and stuff, but, I mean, come on, let's keep some context. This, like, 20-something-year-old woman is playing the role of a baby in a high chair, spelling out the F-word with these dancing toys. We can't call that weird anymore. <laughs> Someone smashed this supposedly pregnant woman's stomach and it was a pinata. What can we call weird now? What's okay to call weird these days? I'm very thankful, I'm very appreciative for the for the request. I'm thankful that people are watching and and actually wanting me to react to stuff that they like, but um, this is strange. I love her voice. She has a great voice, but this is this is a little too odd for my taste. It makes me sad. All the stuff in this video that I saw makes me really sad. I get how some people like take sad feelings and sad tones and, and they try to put a spin on them and like make people feel a sense of community and make them feel better. And I think that's like a lot of what Lady Gaga does. She'll take something that maybe people think of as like sad or dark or lonely or whatever and she'll be like, no, you know, I'm with you. You're not alone. You know, here's your community. We're all... But this one is like, let's bask in it and let's just dwell in our sadness. And that's not good. This is, I think like that could depress people rather than bring them out of it. I, that made me so sad right now. But thanks for requesting. Thank you very much. By the way, we're pushing a new shirt this week, the No Filter T-shirt. This is for everyone. Whether you're out and you're looking good and you want people to know that you're au naturel and you've got no filter, or whether you're out looking like a dirt bag and you've got your PJs on and you're saying, don't judge me. I've got no filter. Wait till tomorrow and I'll, I'll look good again. But today I've, I've got no filter. Ain't got time for that. Get the shirt, support us, allow us to keep doing what we're doing. And not only that, but a lot more. We'd like to invest more time and resources into this channel and start putting out even way more things besides reaction videos, but we have to be able to fund that to do so. And I don't want this to become like a PBS telethon. I'm just saying, hey, if you put something out cool and you think it's interesting and you'd like to get it, get it. If not, whatever. But if you, if you can, please get it. Contest time. If you would like to be in the running to win a $25 Amazon gift card from me, all you have to do is answer this question. Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Mine are FoosyTube, Danny Duncan, Philip DeFranco, Good Mythical Morning, Bro Science. There's no certain number to it. You can share as many or as little as you'd like. I would just like to get an idea of what you guys like to spend your time on, what you think is funny, what you think is interesting. You can answer in this video and in all the other uploads this week, I'll be asking the same question. So the more times you answer, the more chances you have to win the gift card. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys next time.